day two Pokemon Go Fest 2022. Yesterday I walked away with eh, six shinies. We'll see if we can beat that today. Apparently, the odds are worse today, but that doesn't mean we're not going to get some more. So we'll click on the special research, which is this Ultra Recon person, not Professor um, Willow. So he's talking to us about wormholes. Get through all that to the tasks are. Spin tempo, cassaps or gyms, hatch an egg, complete two field research tasks. Both things I'm gonna to have to go out to do, so let's see if there's anything in the today section. Um nope, not really apart from the global challenge. Uh my come my actual research, catch five Pokemon, hatch an egg. Um Pretty much everything I'm going to have to leave the house to do. It's pouring down with rain, so that's going to be fun, but I am planning on going out. So, let's get to this. So we're currently getting ready to go out. We're going to be going out very soon to start raiding some Night Legos and all that sort of stuff. But, just found myself a shiny Litleo. And he just knocked that Pokeball away. Come on, asshole. Uh, I'm going to Golden Razz this just so don't run away. So my first shiny of the day, it's 11.43. I know obviously playing inside is not the best. It's not going to deliver the best results. Um, we're just getting uh, things ready, ready to go out. That eye is really bloodshot. Wow. Uh, just caught myself a shiny Litleo. First shiny of the day. Um, not sure whether to evolve it or not. My luck weren't good enough to find that Meditite shiny as well. Uh, yeah, so Go Fest day two. We're going to be going out in a minute. Hopefully find some shinies out and about. I'm going to do some raids. going to find some more spawns and we'll see what happens. So we just travelled down, we're going to do some Naya Lego raids and hopefully some Kyogre raids if we can get some people on board to do them. Uh, I was getting the wife to check shinies for me on the way down here and I managed to find a shiny Axew on the way down here. So uh, one of the most coveted shinies of the day is now mine. So that's two shinies so far, um, Litleo and Axew. So as you can see there's a Naya Lego raid, we're going to try and get people involved to do it. Uh, I'm also going to try and do so. There's a few Naya Lego raids happening around here. So we're going to just basically see what we can do and try and find some shinies. You can try and find something other than a swan of today. Find anything. <laughs> uh, it's going to be a fun one. So we've just found a Naya Lego raid. We're doing it now. So it can't be shiny, but it's a brand new Pokemon release. It's the big main theme of the day. So using ground types, fighting types, water types, grass types, all that sort of stuff. And we're taking it out pretty quick because we've got six people in the raid. So. <laughs> all right, so we're just taking it out. Six rare candies. Hey, I got charged and ready. Twenty-seven ninety-seven. What's yours? Oh. Yeah, me too. Catching this with one hand while I'm filming with the other hand is. Yeah, mine's slightly better than yours. Really struggling to catch this thing. 2797, I don't even know what the IV is going to be on that. You watch this be on window and I'm going to end up losing it. Now I got it. Managed to get the Dia Lego. Do an IV check on it. I'm recording my screen, you don't need to do that. You may as well be looking. Dia Lego, first Ultra Beast recorded in Pokemon Go. Praise it. Oh, that was good. You see the IVs on that? Better than mine. <laughs> Nice. We doing more Naya Lego raids or are we just gonna shiny hunt now? Because I'm gonna be honest, I only cared about getting the one. Yeah, we're not that bothered about getting any more. Well then, what, what are you filming? Nothing now, you moved. Well, just my luck, just found shiny number three for the day. Shiny Rufflet, one, another one that I have in Pokemon Home but not in Pokemon Go, so I'm just gonna catch this. I don't know why I use a Pokeball, that's very risky. Mm -hmm. 
doesn't matter, caught it anyway. Golden razzed it, so that's fine. So, three shinies today so far Litleo, Axew, Rufflet. Three brand new shinies for Pokemon Go for me. Shiny check this pit of. Not shiny. So, just waiting for the missus to get our unofficial national food, Greg's. And while waiting, shiny Sveal. It's a shame I found a load of these on Community Day, but you know what? It adds to me numbers, so I'll take it. Four shinies. We've been out for half an hour. I'm gonna go ahead and say the odds aren't that bad. Got it. I'm gonna call it Greg. This is actually my second Rock Rough raid of the day. I didn't record the first one thinking I was face coming it, but I wasn't face coming it. So I'm doing the second Rock Rough of the day. Thankfully, there was another one just up the road. So I've walked to that now. I'm doing that right this second. Uh, shouldn't be that long to take it out. It's only a one star. Um, I would love to get a shiny rock ruff today. Shiny rock ruff is amazing. It's a nice, nice blue color. I would like to get a shiny rock ruff. Um, that was taken out very quick. I'm just gonna do a shiny check. Uh, I'm not really that fussed on raiding Nia Lego today. Like I've already done one. I've got it now. I know that there's one in the special research as well. So I'll at least get two Nia Legos today. I'm not really gonna be fussed about finding. Uh, a lot more. Wow, well, you got the final strike in this raid that I was the only person doing it. Uh, 20 Premier Balls, and it's not a shiny. Which is a shame, because I really like shiny Rock Ruff, and I would like to, I would have liked to have found one. And I missed completely with that Premier Ball. Throwing with one hand isn't exactly the easiest. Hello, you two. I said we by you. Okay, well I've just finished this raid, so I'm coming back down now. Ah. I'm going back down now. Just finish the raid. Back to my way. Back down we go. Oh, the wife is going to murder me. Shiny number five. I'm a nice. <laughs> How many shinies have you got today, Marilyn? <laughs> Daddy. She's still on zero. It is now quarter past two in the afternoon. I've found my fifth shiny of the day. Brings me up to 11 overall for GoFest 2022. Right, so we've just done a Snorlax raid. We've just defeated it. So we're gonna do a shiny check on it right now. Uh, so far I'm doing probably better than yesterday, which is weird because on Pokemon Go's website, it does say that the odds are, be are better for Saturday than Sunday, but I'm doing quite well today. Uh, the missus still has no shinies, unfortunately for her. Um, I'm gonna see if I can make this shiny number six. 36 seconds, 22 Premier Balls. Don't think that's shiny. It is not. So while sitting here at the park, chilling out for a little bit with me, Orange Tango, found myself my next shiny. I think that's shiny number seven of the day. Shelmet brings me up to, I think, 11 shinies overall in the last uh, 24 hours or so. So that's not too bad. You know, to say that people complained about the shiny odds, um, and apparently Sunday did have worse odds than Saturday, but I'm not doing too badly, and there's still, what, three hours left? So it's taken most of the day, but I finally hatched my 12 egg. Should not have put on the 12 egg. So I'm gonna claim the rewards for the first page. 200 XP, mysterious Pokemon's appeared. New one, but it did not have the decency to be shiny. Click on, have a look at the next page of the research. Right, what we got? Take two snapshots of Pokemon, transfer 10 Pokemon, battle in a raid. All of those, probably can do that before we even leave the park today. So we're back in the car. We've just done a Drogon raid. Well, hopefully going to get the shiny, hopefully. I got the final strike on that one. You got the big one, battled with the largest Pokemon. Not shiny. Where's the place? Same for me, to be fair. Just found the next shiny that I need. Whoa, I was about to just throw a Pokeball at that without any kind of berry, without any kind of like beefed up Pokeball. Just a regular Pokeball at a shiny that's a starter as well, so a bit harder to catch as well. So, just found Chimchar. I've lost track of the shinies now. I think it might be 14 over the last two days, but I'm gonna have to go back and check that, but I think it's about that. Shiny Chimchar, just caught. Uh, I actually only really came out to check for ground types to move on with the research, but uh, if I'm gonna find shiny chim jars and stuff, I'm not gonna say no to that. So 
All right, so I've caught the last ground type that's needed, so you can claim that reward. 22 candies, drawable candies, there we go. So claim the reward, one law module, charge TM. Mysterious Pokemon's appeared, well, given the fact that was drawable candies, I'm gonna assume this is a drawback. It's a swine up, but still. It's a Pokemon that could be shiny, and he doesn't want to get in the Pokeball. So, talking to Re, the Ultra Recon Squad dude again. What's on the next page? Catch 10 Pokemon, 10 nice throws, walk one kilometer. One kilometer is really not that far. So, I guess I'm doing 10 nice throws and catching 10 Pokemon. So we've just finished the walk, one kilometre, catch 10 Pokemon, make 10 nice throws and all that sort of stuff. So we're going to move on to the next page of the research. This is only research story one of two. I'm not going to do the second one today, obviously. Ten, catch 10 different species of Pokemon, complete two field research tasks. I'm going to have to go pick up two of those because I haven't got any, I don't think. Power up 10 Pokemon. I've got a scan task as well, but meh. Um, so I'm probably going to have to pick up at least one of those and then do the other one. Uh, defeat two Go Rocket members. That one, unless I come across some Pokestops with Go Rocket members, it's probably gonna take a while. So just done an Axew raid and <laughs> turned out to be shiny. Two, two shiny Axews in one day, and it does not want to get in this Premier Ball. Two shiny Axews in one day. I'm not gonna complain about, I'm not gonna complain about that. Oh man, my luck today has been insane to say that it's not actually as good luck-wise, apparently, as yesterday or the day before. Uh, well, the day before, what am I on about? As yesterday, but man, two shiny Achus in one day. I'll take that. I'm just gonna move, go up here a bit further because there is a Go Rocket Grunt. That balloon above me, I've already done it. I just didn't bother catching the Pokemon in it. Um, that's all I need to do now for this page of the research. I've already caught my 10 different species of Pokemon. I've already um, completed two field research tasks. So I'm just walking up here now to get this Rocket Go stuff and defeat the Rocket Go grunts. Annoyingly, there's actually one closer. So no, I'm gonna turn back, I'm gonna go back to that one. Uh, so that's on the walk back anyway. So. We have got less than an hour. We've got 40 minutes until the event ends. I'm already happy with my shiny haul. I was already happy with my shiny haul an hour ago. Uh, so anything extra, anything else I get is just extra. Um, the only Pokemon I haven't got shinies that I would have liked um, from this event are, I think Hitmonchan and Numal, but that's about it. Um, everything else I wanted, I got, so. Uh, Larian Weezing, is that going to be shiny? It is not. Just going to head back, grab this Rocket Go poke stuff. Shiny check this Shroomish, that's another one I wanted actually, Shroomish. I've done really well though, like, really well. <laughs> Today, especially. Almost grab that. Spin it. What type is it? Rock types. Raytheon's fine. Heracross is fine. Uh, what's, what moves runs Gyarados? Gyarados is fine. There we go. Raytheon, Heracross, and Gyarados. Good. Water, ice, and fighting type coverage. We're going to start with Pseudo Widow. Your rock type. So Glaceon's fine. I always thought Pseudo Widow was. Oh wow, Sudowoodo is absolutely destroying my Glaceon. We'll go Heracross next then. I always thought uh, Sudowoodo was a grass type growing up. Oh well. But well, that's the Go Rocket Grunt defeated. Unless this is a shiny, I don't really care about catching it. And it wasn't, so don't really care about catching it. We'll get out of there. Shiny check this trubbish. Before we move on, not shiny. Uh, I am tired. I have been walking so much today, but it's all been worth it. This has been a very, very good event for me. Uh, it's not even over yet. We've got another half an hour. No, that's my stack of field research. 
I'm going to stop walking for a sec. Oh, I have actually got another field research task to, to do. Power of Pokemon five times. Didn't realise I still had that one. I thought I'd already done it. Just get a low CP Pokemon that I'm not going to need the uh, the candies for. So power up the Cyndaquil. I might have done that one too many times. But there it is. That's all powered up now. Right, claim that. That's my stack of research, field research again. Right, claim that. Claim these. So I've got two pineapple berries, two premium battle passes, 2022 Stardust. Ultra Beast on the Oak Reach, even counted of late that are far from their homes. I see, the, I the island guardians of Alola, is it? Perhaps they sense the ultra wormholes would appear. Oh, I see. There is story coercion between different events. Okay. Battling. Battle in two raids, use win a raid, use two super effective charge attacks. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not finishing the story today. <laughs> Maybe we should have saved that actually raid until now. Alright, Pokemon Go Fest 2022, day two, out of technically three, because there'll be another event in another day in August, is about to tick down to zero. It's one minute to six and when it does i'm just holding out hope for one last encounter before it does tick over to six but i'm not really holding out a lot of hope in that but we'll see there it is six o'clock the event is now officially over these spawns are all going to start despawning in a minute and there we go regular spawns are showing up now. GoFest 2022 is now over, and you know what? I'm quite happy with the shiny haul I got. I'm just going to search shiny now. As you can see, overall, starting with the Carablast, these are all the shinies I got throughout the two day event Carablast, Trubbish, Burmy, Shelmic, Girafferig, that flying arm was a trap inch, uh, Wailmat, Litleo, Axew, Rufflet, Greg the White uh, Sphil, uh, Ammonite, Shelmic. Infernape and Axew. Today alone, it's everything from the Litleo. The Litleo was the first shiny I got today, so eight shinies overall today. Um, it's not bad. It's not been bad for me. I'm quite impressed and quite happy with the shinies I got. Um, my wife isn't so happy. She got two shinies today. Uh, uh, four yesterday, I think, so six overall. It seems like there's a lot of varied... Um, you know, shiny look throughout the community and I'm not sure what that means whether or not the I don't I don't believe the shiny odds were worse today than they were yesterday let's just put it that way I did get myself a 100% rock rough and wait until night time to evolve that into a midnight lycan rock obviously I did raid for the Nihilago which has got really good IVs so I'm not going to bother getting any more uh, obviously yesterday as well I got the shaman so that has been my video on GoFest 2022 day two. If you have enjoyed this video, please do hit the follow button down. Uh, please hit the subscribe button down below. Follow us for Twitch. This is not Twitch. Uh, <laughs> although you can find me on Twitch on twitch.tv forward slash James of Thunder and go follow me on there to be notified whenever I go live in the future. I go live several times a week, so hitting follow on Twitch is the best way to be notified whenever I do. Also, don't forget to subscribe to me here on YouTube. I'm a small time YouTuber and any and all support is greatly appreciated. Don't forget to comment down below as well how well did you do if you did in fact play GoFest 2022. I've been James of Thunder. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.